welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Megan, and today we're going to be doing a review using Focalure Sweet as Honey palette. If you guys like this look, I'm going to be linking their website down below, and there is also a code that you can use for 20% off. It's Megan, M-E-G-H-A-N 220. All right, now let's get started. All right, you guys, so first I'm gonna go in with some tape. Just gonna tape up the corners here. Then I'm gonna go in using the Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer. I am on the hunt to try new eyeshadow primer, so if you guys have any good recommendations, make sure to put them in the comments down below. Going in with the Sweet as Honey palette with the shade Cosmic Latte and my Sigma E40 brush, I'm gonna put that base all over the eye going to set that outer then using the shade deep peach and same with that Sigma E40 brush I'm gonna go in and kind of do my crease and right up above these shadows are actually blending real nicely and there's like no fallout on the palette at all Just making sure you're doing tiny circles and fluffing it up toward the brow bone. Then using the Morphe E17 brush, it's like this thicker pencil brush, I'm gonna use the shade Pale Chestnut and go in to the crease with this brush. Giving some dimension to the eye. With the same brush, going in with the shade Rosy Brown and doing kind of the same exact thing, just going a little bit lower on the crease. Going back with the Sigma E40 brush and blending with the shade Deep Peach. Just kind of buffing it and blending them all together. Then using my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, I'm going to do a cut crease. I'm going to go in using this random tiny little brush here. When you cut crease, you just wanna make sure you're going all the way up to like where your eye socket is. It gives you that full eye look. And it helps if you're kind of looking down. So I like to use the mirrors on my palette, which this palette comes with like a huge clear mirror, which is awesome. Good for like traveling. Okay, using the Too Faced Glitter Shadow Primer and the same exact brush, I'm gonna just gonna go in, put it on top of the concealer. Then using this Morphe M124 brush, it's this flat brush here. I'm going to use this shade Pure Copper. It's like this shimmery pink purpley color. I'm just kind of pat that on the lid. Then doing the same exact thing to the other eye, putting that glitter glue on first and then packing on that pure copper shade. And there's so many shimmers in this palette and they're all so pigmented. I was swatching a few before. I'll have to show you some on my hand as well. Then going back in with this Morphe E17 brush and I'm gonna go in with Turkish Rose here in the top corner and just kind of do my outer corners. Going in with that rosy brown and going through the crease again. Emphasize it a little bit more. Then I'm going to be using these Violet Voss lashes. I just got them at Target. I don't know if they're new or not. I've never seen them before, but they're in the style Just Slaying. Now that my lashes are on, I'm going to do my lower lash line going in with this Morphe M506 brush. I'm going to go in with that shade Rosy Brown again and just outline my lower lash line. I'm gonna take 
some of this Maybelline eyeliner. Just put some in the outer corners of my eye. Then using the Tarte Mascara and Lights Camera Lashes. All right, so that completes the eyes. I'm just gonna go ahead and swatch a few of these shimmer shades in the back of my hand for you guys. Shade Danger is so cool. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's like a green with like purple and green shimmer to it, depending on like the angle that you get. Kind of reminds me of like a dragon scale. <laughs> is that stupid? <sighs> That's what I picture a dragon scale to look like. And then this shade, Hypnotism, kind of like the same thing. It's like from a certain angle, it looks like a gray, but then from another angle, it has this like purple, purple shimmer. And then this blue Trevi Fountain. Like these are so shimmery and pigmented. These glitters are so pigmented, so glittery, so buttery for the price of a palette. Then I'm going to use their liquid matte lip as well. I'm going to use the shade Nude Pink number 42. And some of the other shades that I got in their matte liquid lips was the shade Persian Plum number five. This is like a rich berry pink here. And then this brown brick red, brick orange red, it's called Medium Carmine in number 48. This is like a really pretty fall color, especially us girls with the dark hair. Looks so nice on everyone. All right, you guys, so that completes this look using the Sweet as Honey palette. Make sure to hit the like button down below, comment what you'd like to see in future videos, and make sure to hit the subscribe button. And also make sure if you guys go on their website and check out any of their palettes, you can use my code Megan, M-E-G-H-A-N 20 for 20% off. All right, you guys, bye.